Fusion Mobile Quality E-Learning Experience on the Go. Having come to that, we mark the end of our discussion on political culture. We now move ahead to political socialization. What does it mean to socialize? Somebody would say it means to interact, to communicate, okay, to move along. Then in the political aspect of it, how do we define political socialization? It is defined as the process of acquiring political beliefs, values, attitudes, as well as citizenship training that shapes a citizen's political behavior. It is also the process of political learning from childhood to adulthood. It is a lifelong developmental process. Agents of political socialization. Number one, we have the family unit. Transmission of knowledge about politics, authority, and allocation of values starts at home. The child's knowledge and experience of political activities starts at the family unit. Number two, peer group. The group one moves with helps to dictate or at least influence one's political emotion. Number three, the mass media, radio, televisions, newspapers, disseminate a lot of political news and also analyze political issues, thereby socializing listeners, readers and viewers politically. Number four, learning institutions, schools, colleges and other educational institutions provide avenue for political talks, debates and discussions which are basic socializing mechanisms. Number five, political parties. They help in educating their members and other people through their manifesto, campaign, rallies, etc. thereby stimulating people's political awareness. 